Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Tisha Sade and I'm back with another video. So today's video is going to be, as you can tell from the background, it's going to be a serious topic and it's pretty much dealing with health, food, veganism, all of that fun stuff. Hooray! Okay, so today's video is going to be where to find vegan items in the market, in the freezer section, and in the produce section in most markets. So if you're interested in where to find vegan items, frozen food edition, because there is an addition to this series as well. Well, an addition is a series. So this is the frozen food edition and the outside of the produce. Some markets do have a bunch of vegan stuff outside of produce. And you'll see pictures. So don't worry. You will not just see me and my beautiful face and this black backdrop and my black hair and my black shirt like I'm about to go rob someone. No, you will see pictures. This is why I'm sitting here. So if you're interested in vegan finds, continue to watch guys. I'm going to break this down by section and then by the brand. Okay guys, so first up we have the produce section the vegan section i'm sorry the vegan section in the produce area is usually sectioned off in most markets so i haven't been to every market in even my state so i'm not sure where you shop how it is but in the market that i should that i do shop in it is like off to the side and i think that's in most markets so it's like a, you're looking for a small focal point in the produce section Okay, some markets may have it not even in the produce section, but for the most part, it is. Now, as far as the brands that you will find in this section, you have Light Life, Field Rose, and the Jackfruit Company. Okay, and then sometimes you'll find Butter, Earth Balance Butter. Um, yeah, so the first brand is Light Life. Now, in that section, you'll find Light Life Deli Slices, pepperoni you'll also find the tempeh you'll definitely find their hot dogs and i have tried their hot dogs those hot dogs are good okay you'll find the ground beef and it comes in like yeah you'll also find bacon and sausages other products from light life are their meatballs their beef crumbles lean like ground beef type meat burgers, smart tenders, hot dogs, probably in a frozen section. So that is it for Light Life. The next brand is Field Roast, one of my favorites. And this brand is definitely a OG vegan brand. They still have their labels as vegetarian, the original vegan. I don't know how, like, whatever, that's another whole video. But we're labeled vegans now. But they still have their items labeled as vegetarian. Guys, do not worry if you are trying to be full course vegan. Their products are vegan. Now, if all of them are vegan, I'm not sure. But the products that I'm mentioning are definitely, definitely vegan, but they still do have vegetarian. So no, it is no dairy in these products whatsoever. They're completely what is considered today vegan as vegan. So, in the produce section, you'll find Field Rose sausages, their breakfast sausages. I'm telling you, some of the best sausages I've ever had. Vegan, non-vegan, in any situation, they have the best sausages. They also have the mini breakfast sausages. And in like specialty health markets, you'll find them in, not the freezer section, you'll find them in like a, the refrigerated section. So yeah, they also have meatloaf, hamburgers, deli slices, corn dogs, buffalo hot wings. That is in the freezer section, okay? So, oh my gosh, the best. If I ever have a taste for hot wings, I'm not missing out on anything. Okay, so another thing I like about Fear Roast is they also have the Celebration Roast for the holidays, but I like to get it. Some brands only put their celebration roses out during the holidays, but filled roast, I can get their celebration roast all year round. So the third 
brand that you'll find in the produce section and you will find some of their products in the freezer section as well just like Phil Rose is the jackfruit company okay now in the produce section the jackfruit company will have their prepared jackfruit meal and it'll range from their Tex-Mex barbecue um, they have a teriyaki so everything will be plastered yeah so other items from the jackfruit company you may or may not find in the produce section are their ripe jackfruit and the regular jackfruit but everything else is prepared or meal starters okay and here are some of the meal starters okay guys on to the freezer section now depending on where you live okay or what market you shop in you will have some of these items or you just won't so first up in the freezer section okay i think we all know where the freezer is right yeah okay got it good is worthington now this is fast becoming one of my favorite brands it's i believe it's a new brand or it's new where i'm at okay so things that worthington had they have a dinner roast they also have deli slices. They have steak. They have hot dogs or what they call deli dogs. And they also have burgers. And that is it for Worthington. Let me tell you one thing about them. Them dang on deli slices, I had to say, wait a minute, let me email this company because I think they fooling us out here. I think this is real meat. Oh my gosh, them deli slices are, they are so good. So I'm on the hunt for every other product up is Beyond Burgers or Beyond Meat. Okay, so fun fact about Beyond Burgers or Beyond Meat, they started out with Beyond Chicken. It was a fail, so they swiped their chicken tenders up off of the shelves and discontinued them okay and i was i was buying it I, I liked it i didn't see an issue so now beyond meat is focusing on their burgers and fried chicken with kfc i hear okay had to give y'all the tea in vegan news okay so products of beyond meat burgers sausage beef crumbles Okay, so the next company is one of my faves, and it is the Boca Company. And the Boca Company specializes in burgers, Boca beef crumbles. They also have nuggets, chicken patties, and falafel. That is it for the Boca Company. The next company is the Alpha Company. See, I only thought that they specialized in burritos and Popeyes because that's all I see in my local market. And that's only in one market, okay? But no, this company not only have Popeyes or Hot Pockets, whatever you want to call them. They also have burritos. They also have sausage, pizza, chicken strips, or in the vegan world, we call them chick nut strips, tamales, nuggets, chicken patties, beef crumbles, and beef crumble sausages for your breakfast scrambles guys that is major and burgers so i did try the alpha company's popeyes i tried the chicken one and i tried the cheesy beef and the chicken one i loved okay but the cheesy beef i think i overcooked that one i cannot wait to try the other products so i am going to be on the lookout for their other products because they do have many and i think it's also a new company correct me if i'm wrong but a lot of things come late to the east coast the next company is corn and that's spelled with a q and 
they have vegan and vegetarian and regular items. I do believe they have regular items. Okay. So they have fishless sticks, chicken patties, buffalo dippers, and that's it for corn. So the next company, guys, that you can find in the freezer section is Dr. Prager's. Now, Dr. Prager's is another one of those companies that they're more so on the vegetable forming burger side. So their burgers tend to come off as a veggie patty and that's okay because not all the time do you need to be eating a Beyond or an Impossible Burger, okay? So you need to come onto the help side and give Dr. Prager's a go. Okay, and they do have many different burgers. Okay, are we done with all of the burgers that Dr. Prigger has? Because they, they got a lot. Okay. <laughs> they also have sausages, nuggets, tater tots, and hash browns. That is it for Dr. Breaker. So the next company, guys, is one of my faves, and it's Sophie's because the fish, okay? So you guys think that we don't get our fix when it comes to seafood. <laughs> you did it wrong, okay? So Sophie specializes in crab cakes. My favorite. Fish fillets. Shrimps. Y'all, them shrimps be banging, okay? <laughs> Tuna and salmon. And just a quick FYI, they never have the shrimp, the raw one, the vegan raw shrimp. Because we got some people that be like, oh, you still eat shrimp? Now it's all vegan for crying out loud. Okay, so I can never be able to order the regular shrimp. I always get the breaded ones. The breaded ones are still good and I still, man, you talking about some good, and it tastes just like the thing. So we can leave the shrimps alone and let them clean up the ocean like they're supposed to. Next company is the OG okay the goat okay and it's guardian or guardian or however you pronounce it but we say guardian here okay guardian specializes in burgers chicken tenders or chicken fingers chicken patties breakfast sausages the best the best, the best breakfast sausage. I did say Phil Roast was the best, right? Okay, they're like this. Wings. Meatballs. Beef crumbles. Fish fillets. Oh. <laughs> Sliders. Fridays, take notes. Guardian has slider for vegans. Regular and breakfast sausages. Pork, chicken strips or chick knot strips. Is it cutlets, chicken cutlets, or just like chicken breasts? I don't know, still good. Guardian also have prepared meals. with some breakfast scrambles up in there, guys. Get into it, I'm telling you, good stuff. Thank you, thank you, Guardian. Good job, good job, good job. Give yourselves a pat on the back. Okay, I might have forgot something from Guardian, but they have so much stuff. Anywho, the next company, guys, is Amy's. Amy's is another OG, she's been around for a long time, okay? She specialized in some of my favorite mac and cheese on the go, okay? Mac and cheese, 
she specializes in a number of bowls. So here they are. Okay, is that it for the bowls? It, that's a lot, that's a lot. Burritos. Pizza. Burgers. Chocolate. Breakfast scrambles. Meatballs. Lasagna. Wraps, soups, her soups are good, okay? So if you need that wintertime quick meal. And the last brand, guys, is Sweet Earth, okay? I am not a big fan of Sweet Earth, although I did try their Carry Bowl and their General TSO Bowl. I'm not gonna say that, because I think it's so-so, but <laughs> Those are the two bowls I tried. The curry one, I didn't like because I swear to you, I'm a Jamaican. <laughs> so I like Jamaican curry, but I did like the general TSO bowl, um, the Asian inspired bowl. They have a lot of Asian inspired things because I think that's their focal point. Um, but doing my research, I read that they have alcohol in all of their ingredient lists on all of their products. So with that knowledge, I ain't supporting that company, but you can. So that's why I'm bringing it to you. Although I don't recommend you, you know, just get drunk off of eating. You know, it says straight up alcohol. And I think that that is jacked up that you're just putting alcohol in your food and yeah, but whatever, that's the video for another day. But Sweet Earth, specializes in bowls, pizza, and Hispanic foods. And their bowls are definitely Asian inspired. And they also have cauliflower mac with alcohol. <laughs> okay, okay, no shade, no shade. So that is it for the freezer section. If I miss the brand or if I miss your favorite brand, I do apologize guys, okay? Um, I kind of went off of what I see in the market all the time in the freezer section, okay? Keep in mind this video was only for the freezer section. I will have other videos coming on other sections in the market or other brands that specialize in other things. So you will have more lists coming to you. So with that being said, friends, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.